Pig Lamp Fam Linwood here, and today I'm gonna to be doing another hairstylist reaction video. Now, before anyone says anything, I know I don't look like a hairstylist. We're all on day 5,000 of quarantine, so why am I gonna be doing the most to be doing nothing? Doing it up to not be doing it out. Like, I don't understand. So, nonetheless, it's up here like this. It's a mess, and I'm gonna do a reaction video because you guys have requested it infinity billion times. So, let me go ahead and figure out again how to turn on my screen record because I'm not a real YouTuber and the struggle is real. Say hi to Catherine. Catherine is my mannequin. I show all sorts of tutorials on her. She's amazing. Gotta love her. Hey, Catherine. She hangs out with us on weekends. So, I was planning on doing some Troom Troom videos because someone told me in the comments of my last reaction video that Troom Troom is actually a sister company of 5 Minute Crafts and as much as I felt some type of way with five minute crafts. I tried to do a Troom Troom hair reaction, but it just felt like it was like 29 levels beneath me and I just couldn't. It's entirely too much. So I decided what I'm going to do is go ahead, I'm going to type in hair fails. Uh, oh, hair fails compilation 2020. That sounds current and up to date and I think we can make some things happen. Oh, okay, so let's scroll. Let's see what we can find. Oh, we have fire. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and go for this one because it has fire in there, so I feel like it's bound to be full of some extraness and some shenaniganery. I'm gonna try my hardest not to be too rough because, um, you know, these are the Lord's children and some of them just simply don't know any better. Uh, oh, I've seen this one. Oh my gosh, so crazy. Like, why would you even, why? Uh, so first of all, I get, <laughs> I get that y'all thought it was cute to make lighter earrings, but the fact that you did not consider that your hair is very much flammable and tried to light it to show the authenticity of these lighters, thank goodness it wasn't pierced somewhere else because you could have been tittyless in Seattle. Anyway, moving on. This one right here is not a hair fail of 2020, so I don't know if they meant like we just uploaded this video in 2020, but I've seen this one infinity billion times. At any rate, this is why it's important to go ahead and get a temperature for your hair rather than trying to put it on 4 billion degrees. Like the fact that they put some of these things on 465 degrees, like let this sink in. You don't even let cookies bake at that temperature, but you're gonna bake your hair at that temperature. Like let's use all of the good sense that the good Lord gave, okay? Moving along. Pope. I know she was on like 14 and she was grounded. I heard all about this situation. Okay, so this is the one that was in the, wait, why is she playing with this lighter? Oh no, oh well it's a weave. Girl, you be a right. Yeah. At least it didn't burn up her corny or nothing. Yeah, you good to go, boo. You good. What's going on here? Uh-uh. Oh, Lord! <laughs> I feel like everyone watching just had a flashback or something because the fact that he just put that flat iron like dead on her scalp, like things I can't with. You know, instantly makes me think like that wasn't the iron, it was the grease. <laughs> Like things I cannot with. I feel like every every black person watching just had a total flashback to Easter Sunday prep. <laughs> and I am so sorry. I am going to put some resources to counselors down in the comment section below. And by some resources to counselors, I mean some my bads in the comments. That's about as good as it's gonna get. I don't have that kind of money. Okay, so we're in a salon. We got, wait a minute, wait a uh, doggone minute. Why are we putting tape-ins in like this? These tape-ins are clip-ins. Girl, what are we doing? What manner of horse tailery? Uh, entirely too much. Oh my gosh, you're trying to snatch the back of this child ball. This got to be that Russian stuff. It, and hold on, pause, because someone's going to take that the wrong way. When I say that Russian stuff, I mean like the Russian methods of styling, things like that. Like they can do some really amazing hairstyles, but the way that they do it are contrary to so much that makes sense in the life of a hairstylist in terms of the way they've been putting in these extensions. Now, they usually get gorgeous outcomes. Don't get me wrong. And some Russian hairstyles are some of the best hairstyles I've ever seen. Maybe they turn in nothing into something. However, comma, I just feel like the fact that you started with this whole dog on horsetail, I feel... It doesn't matter how I feel. Let's go ahead. I feel like y'all been curling for centuries. Lord. Oh, we gonna make a flower or something? Okay. Or this whole hairstyle held together by hairspray. Mm -mm. 
Mm -mm. Lord, look like a big old blonde piece of hair poop. Like for why? Part of me felt like I was gonna be like joyfully disappointed, like this was gonna finish nothing. Like this is so cute, but your hair should not all move as one piece. Like this, it looks like a big old piece of doo doo. Just, ugh. I said I was gonna be nice. Hair blood, but you know she's a stylist. I don't know. It's. Oh, okay. I've seen this. That's not how you do finger waves, y'all. Please don't, don't do this. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay, so we're making some baby hair Vaseline. Wait. Flexing edges. Okay. Girl, what are you brushing? Your imagination? No, this feels like a long tail tutorial that don't show nothing. Sweet gee, I gotta pause. This girl done spent about 5,000 hours on her edges that still look about the same right now. Like, how much brushing are you doing with that? Do you pay this much attention to your teeth when you're brushing them? That's all I wanna know, because Lord, you've been brushing these little four strands for the longest, and it's not that you don't have plenty of hair on your hairline, it's just that I just don't understand all of this. Like, was this just to put the Vaseline in your hair for shine? Because, it's, you know what? Something miraculous is gonna happen. It is. We just gonna. Hairspray. I don't understand. Oh, we're not done. Okay. Bye, Ethan. Wait, where are we? Oh, okay, she's getting her brows waxed. Oh, no! <laughs> Oh Lord, I have seen this happen <laughs> in cosmetology school so many times. Like for those who don't know, I'm a cosmetology instructor and I don't know why it is that seeing a whole eyebrow come off with a wax strip gives me so much joy. Between that and listening in on bikini waxes, I don't know why, it's just hilarious to me because the level of screaming and the level of like, what am I gonna do? It's just, it's hilarious to me. And I, you know what, the Lord is still working on me there. But he ain't working that hard, so we just gonna, um, <laughs> oh lord, <laughs> this poor child, okay, <laughs> mm. uh-uh, mm-mm, uh, first of all, oh lord, I don't know why it is everyone is so obsessed with trying to wax the inside of their nose out, like, I get it, there's some hair hanging, like trim it or something, but I need those, Corona's going around, and we ain't trying to have that flying all up in my nostrils, the devil is an entire lie, so we're not gonna do that. Um, I don't know what they're using to do this, but I see this go wrong more times than not, so I have learned through the internet to never, ever attempt to wax the inside of my nose out. Uh, honestly, if you're gonna do something like that, it's not, like, it looks like people are trying to use Q-tips or something, which really isn't smart. Um, I would say, like, probably, like, some form of popsicle stick because it's dirty, but even still, I wouldn't even go for that because I'm sorry, you don't know how you're gonna get that out your nose if it gets stuck. Like, you're not qualified. Child, and ain't nobody trying to rip a whole head of weave out their nostril. Uh, she just tee-hee-ha-ha. -ha. How you gonna get it out? Oh, uh, poor child. Baby, this is what overprocessed hair looks like. This is why I tell you guys not to pull relaxer through your hair, not to do your own relaxer, not to do your own bleach. I have seen this happen so many times. And at this point, this is what we call cotton candy hair because that's what it feels like when it's dry. But when it's wet, we call it bubble gum hair because that's what it feels like when it's wet. <laughs> the world may never learn. At this point, there is not much you can do uh, when your hair is shedding like this, you need a protein treatment and you need a whole lot of Jesus and you're gonna need some moisture and you're gonna have, like your whole life is protein from then on out until that hair is gone. Cause uh, baby, otherwise you will be shedding like a malting bird or something. It's gonna be a lot. <gasps> oh no. Oh Lord, Moses, you did the doggone thing. Po, po child, Lord. I just need Jesus be a closure. Jesus be, oh Lord. Uh. I can't take no more with that one. I got to skip forward. I got to. It's too much. It's too much. It's still going. It's... <laughs> no. Uh, okay. 
<laughs> Hold on. <laughs> if I ever, if I ever run for president, I promise you my slogan will be pin it to win it. 2000, whatever year it is, because when I tell you I'm so sick of seeing wigs fly off on social media, like pin it down. That's all I gotta say. Mm-mm, mm-mm. Girl, what type of scissors are the, uh-uh. I honestly thought it was gonna be worse. What you really expect and wish. No, mm-mm. I never expect or wish for anyone to set my hair on fire to cut it. And I've seen these videos, I just don't understand what the obsession is with these. Why it is that people are talking, like, the salon must be so stank for this. Why? And y'all just over here just do, 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 do. I can't. Like, I, ain't nothing, <laughs> ain't nothing normal about cutting hair like this. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Why, Lord, uh-uh. <laughs> it look like every time I talk back to my mama in childhood. <laughs> uh. <laughs> okay, so from scrolling through, all the rest of these look to be exactly the same. So, because of the fact that I didn't want to get any copyright strikes, I'll try to throw some music or something over this video. But nonetheless, I hope that you enjoyed this video. I hope that you enjoyed these reactions. And for anyone that I seemed really harsh for, I'm sorry. <laughs> I didn't mean to talk about your whole entire existence like that. I promise I didn't. But it just, I can't help it sometimes. And I'm sorry. But if you enjoyed this video, please make sure to check out my last hairstylist react. And please be sure to subscribe. Leave comments in the comment section down below. Until next time, you guys, take care. God bless and stay glam. And you know I love you, boo. Even from quarantine. <laughs> Bye.